Hey everybody, welcome to another Tripwire Community Game Night. How's everyone doing? I'm doing fine. <laughs> oh, you weren't I... asking me. No, you're you're everybody. <laughs> so I am Mia Molly Kitten Mittens, whatever you may come across me named as on the internet, and I am community coordinator with Tripwire Interactive. And with me is Yoshiro or Jared, who is community manager. And then we have um, a special guest, Cruise Control. Uh, hello. Say hello. Um, he has helped uh, develop a mod that we're going to play tonight called Zed Turtle. So, Reborn. Reborn. Zed so. Turtle Reborn. So, so uh, yeah. For th those who, of you who are watching on Twitch, uh, Molly is the lead and you're watching her. Uh, and for those of you joining us on YouTube, I am the lead. Hello. And you're watching me. And you can watch both of us Crazy. and see who's better. But I bet I'm going to die first. Uh, it's, it's a competition that <laughs> we both excel at. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to do some Zeternal. Um, I think with us already in the game, we have <clears throat> Ek4, um, one of our community moderators. Awesome, nice guy that has probably assisted many people in one way or another with much more patience than, than most people have. It's, it's, what uh, is Zeternal, you say? I was going to say, I have a similar question over here on YouTube, is what's the difference between Zeternal and, like, Endless Mode? So, Cruz, why don't you, we put you on the spot and tell us what oh. is Zeternal? <laughs> Well, Zed Turtle Reborn is what happens when you combine a highly customizable endless game mode with roguelike elements and an urgent need for dosh. Players will require both skill and luck to survive as they buy their way to glory via the static perk trees as well as randomly unlocked skills, weapons, and upgrades. This, Yoshiro and Molly, it differs from the original Endless game mode in that uh, the entire upgrade system has been completely changed, where you buy perks instead of selecting a perk at the beginning of the match, and you get random skills within those perks, which you can then also purchase. You also can purchase upgrades to the weapons. You can modify your knife and your grenade for free at any time. Essentially, it just kind of turns it into more of a super customizable highly randomized game mode, essentially, as I said before, that uh, allows for quite a bit of a different experience, and it changes things pretty much every time. So it's pretty much maximum chaos, essentially. So you're taking a what is arguably a very chaotic game, Killing for 2, and you have <laughs> made it arguably <laughs> crazier. Some would say better. Some would say worse. How, how do you... <laughs> Many people would say worse. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, where, where does that line kind of land right there? I think well, it depends on your mood, right? Like it sometimes depends on your mood. Yeah. Sometimes you want a very structured, you know what's gonna happen kind of game. Other times you're like, I need more. I thirst for something different. And then he plays a And turn. then Emperor Wave comes up and then you get crushed by a two story tall screen. Yeah. Can that, can that come wave one? Is is that an option or is that gonna come later on in life? It's purely randomized right now, um, but you could absolutely modify your Zeternal Reborn config to give you Emperor on Waypoint if you so desired. Okay. Well, hopefully that answers our two questions uh, from Leviathan over here on YouTube <coughs> and whoever it was over there on Twitch. Uh, thank you guys for such great questions to start the chat. I'm going to um, put up and no, Blaze, we are not server? running Vanilla. We are running Zeternal Reborn, which is a mod, uh, as we have just discussed, which is currently maintained and run by Cruz here in chat with us. And Fleet Killer. I'd like to just point out real quick, I yes. have to Sorry. say without a doubt, Fleet Killer is the number one king of this mod. I am more or less just HR. I don't have a clue how code works, but... I do know as much about the mod as anyone could be expected to, and I'm here to just basically help out and uh, promote and answer people's questions. So uh, if you're looking for someone who's running the official Zetron Reborn community Discord server, that's me. And if you have questions, you're always free to send them my way, and I'll do my best to be able to help people do what they want to do with the game mode, essentially. But awesome. Fleet Killer just... is number one. Thank you, uh, and my apologies to Fleet Killer. Uh, I shall try and remember to call him out as much as possible. 
and I have linked the mod over in YouTube chat in case anybody wants to join us because that is something we do here on Community Game Night. We invite you, the community, to come join us. Uh, we just have a few simple rules, which I don't know how that's going to play out here with an endless mode, uh, but we do try and cycle people in and out so lots of people have a chance to play with us and carry the day. Uh, anything else you want to add to that, Molly? Uh, yeah, so I think what we're, we're trying to do, because this is an endless experience, um, we've got increased players, so we'll have eight players with us at a time, um, and then we've kind of started this game mode out as if you've already played how many? Ten? or Fifteen. We're going to be 15. starting on wave 15. So we're si starting on wave 15. But you can adjust with the mod how much DOS you start with and, and stuff like that. So people can come in and, and still buy some stuff and catch up. Um, and then, I don't know, I'm thinking we normally do like five. Or, I mean, like four rounds. I don't know. You try doing five, kind of like on Endless. And see how that goes. Or if we feel like that's too short. I don't know. I feel like we'll just have to be like, okay, that's enough at some point and call it and start it over. So also, we, we can survive five waves too. Yeah, so it's we're starting out. This is a harder mode, so we might not even make it very far. <laughs> so this is sort of a challenge. I have put up on my screen um, how to join. The password is ZT. So you're going to open up your console, press uh, with F3, type in open kf2.northarc.com, and the password equals uh, ZT. And no I quotes. put that into chat because I don't have a fancy overlay set up, and that's something I could do now that I think about it. Oh, yeah. I could just send you mine, I guess. Well, no. Uh, mine's a little bit different, but I could set that up. Hold on. I can do it. We have the power. I have the technology. Um, so let me flip back to the game. Been alt tabbed. The people's okay. So oh, there comes people's. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We've got eight, and that's how many. So we're going to see how this goes with eight players. And I was sad because I just got my overlay up. So next time, I'm ready. Oh, you had it? You I can know. show it if you want. Go ahead and show look, it. Look, look, I have an overlay now. See, look, I did it. I'm special, too. Professionals. We're good at our jobs. Yeah, and since this is a little tougher, we will have a harder time keeping an eye on chat. Uh, so kind of, you it might kind of have to wait for like some downtime, but uh, oh, we will. And there, there is one more thing, uh, which I think would be wise to mention now, uh, and I raise it because uh, Gusto here says season pass is very nice. Is I do believe we have two season <laughs> passes for Steam to give away today. Uh, one for those of you following on Twitch, and one oh, for those of you following yes. on YouTube. Yes, that will right, be happening. So let's later on. Let's go ahead. Um, let's start those before we start and start okay. collecting entries. Okay. Are we going to do it by keyword, active user? Um, keyword. Keyword. Okay. Um, I am. <laughs> Moobot's like, don't you want to upgrade? <coughs> don't you? Sorry, Moobot, you're doing a really good job for free for me. Uh, archive this old one. Let's see, I'm just going to leave it. Let's just keep the keyword as as armory. Yes, hold on. Uh, Let me set mine up. Doing it live. Armory pass. Uh, 
There we go. And now it's dead. It is running. So if you are interested and watching and are in the Twitch chat, enter oh. Armory. Hold on one second. I I did the bad thing. Sorry, guys. I wasn't oh, no. uh, ready to roll it just yet. Uh, sorry, <laughs> 009. Uh, I hit the wrong button. So, Let's go ahead and put Armory into chat and let's get going. There we go. They're coming in. All right, that is working. Let's. Are we going to try to play now? Yeah, let's try and play. Should we? Emphasis on try. Try our best. Let me try to dangle all these tabs again in a way that makes sense. My screen's going to be black until I give KF2 focus again, I think. Sorry. And speaking of those wonderful weapons, quite the large list now in the Armory Season Pass, so. Oh, yeah. So what is what is an Armory Season Pass? That's a good so, question. So uh, in Killing Floor with this last update, you can now get all the um, DLC weapons for this year that will come out in the future through 2021. And it also gives you all the past ones we have already released. Sort of a one one shop uh, bundle to get you caught up on all the good stuff. So if that sounds interesting to you and you're not the grand winner from tonight, definitely think about checking it out. Because it also helps us keep bringing you great content for Killing Floor 2. <laughs> All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's do this. Ready, Ekvor Karius. <laughs> oh, if he doesn't, uh, we're doomed. Don't expect me to. Seds are evolving. Slashers are enraged. Crawlers are faster, and Gorefast deal more damage. That sounds terrifying. <laughs> Welcome to the Zed buffs. So we uh, set up so that everyone have three minutes, so you okay. have a chance to just kind of understand what you're looking at. <laughs> but who thought yeah. at any point in their life that crawlers needed to be faster? Like, why? Um, why did you think that? <laughs> why not? You know, sometimes they just need to get where they need to get a little faster. They they don't have the capacity to climb Turn walls. So okay. They have okay. to get it over the stairs, right? That's difficult. I'm gonna go for some support. Well, oops. I can't buy uh never mind. Alright. I've made some life choices. <laughs> we'll see how it works for me. <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. My allergies lately. Let's see your weapon upgrades. I spent all my money, oh, so I, I can't so buy far, a perk. So... Already? Oh, wait. No, I didn't. I still have some. Oh, yeah. I was told to get the gas mask as a um, priority. Um, yes. So you're not looking at bloat bile constantly. All right. That's going to be an um, equipment, right? Or... Yes, yes be your that's equipment. equipment. So right. you see here, guys, you've got this whole perk up upgrade place. Look, you can even choose your grenade. What grenade do I want? Do I want to be like a helpful? I'm a demolitionist uh, with a medic grenade. Yeah, I. That feels. Kukri. That seems right, right? We all just get. Let's all get medic grenades. <laughs> and you can even adjust your uh. Your knife. What knife should I have? I like the pyro knife. Okay. But I don't really... Oops. 
I should buy. Bastard. I should buy something for support. I mean, a precious. Oh my. I've made some life choices in regards to uh, my perk skills. So. Should I oh. just right off the bat get a a doomstick? Alright, so I am dual specking into I'll support and this. demo. That seems reasonable. I'm not spending enough money. I don't... Well, you're out of time. You're out of time. Everybody's out of time. Probably get out of Oh! Time. Wait, where? Alright, thank you, Blaze. We're gonna try and do quote unquote just fine. What can go wrong? Yeah, let's let's hold the zone. That seems reasonable, right? Because obviously this is just a normal round I and a nothing stick. bad could possibly happen. I don't feel comfortable here. <laughs> this... I've angered it. I'd like to run away now. Oh! Um, stalkers are supposed to die when I shoot them with grenades. <laughs> you might facing a, a stalker omega so that would probably be why um and what about that angry man let's make him go away <laughs> so you'll notice that that some of the sides might look a little different and those are the ones that are affected by some of the changes Yes, uh, Zed Terminal Reborn includes some custom Zeds. Basically, uh, just much paler, purple eyed demons, which uh, are much bigger than their usual counterparts. I'm sorry, there was a slight hiccup oh. there? Could you say that again? <laughs> demons? Was it? Is that a correct pronunciation? Just asking for a friend. There's always a pause and then. <laughs> demons! Okay, okay. That's reasonable. You heard okay. it here first. That's official information. 100%. Oh, that's, boy. That is... But yeah, um, they have some of them have special abilities. So, for example, the Omega Flesh Pound has a Ground Pound ability where he will just launch himself at you and explode and you will die. That sounds awful. That sounds fun, doesn't it, kids? Yeah. Fun. Oh. With, with a capital F U. Well, so far we're not doing too bad. That's a Skrig. And I'm dying. Somebody should help me from these two Skrigs that want me dead. Help! I forgot about Emma. <laughs> I'm throwing health down. I hope you all enjoy. This has been your friendly what medic support demo man. Here? Providing additional assistance. If you have a really tough time, you can always try to pull out your knife. Ooh! As you will oh. get a little bit of health back if you don't have any Berserker perks. I have to oh, stay what? in the zone, do we? Ah, oh. I'm died. Dead. Those words. Oh my gosh. This is where I die, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh. that, that did feel like we started in the middle of the game. Also felt we should have run away from that position sooner. We, we have, really uh, were stubborn about yeah, holding out held the, our guns in the there. purple zone. That was was kind of silly. Um, let's see. I think the team's got this. They'll carry us, right? Uh, Bruce, I have a lot probably. of faith in you. Come on. All right. Um. Yep. Aww. Faith in Cruise over. Faith in boss like I'm Maximum sorry. has begun. Just a reminder that we have an armory pass that we are giving away. So be sure to type armory into the chat. For a chance to win. And that also goes uh, for the same over here on those watching me on YouTube. Uh, let's see if I can answer any questions here in chat. Uh, Mountain Dew Segoy, uh, yes, we are working hard on a hotfix to address, uh, the issues with the gravity imploder causing instability on that platform. 
Uh, I don't have any news to share, but that is the team's number one priority right now. Uh, James Sorrell, you'll want to do it lowercase. I believe it is a thing that matters. So, lowercase is the way to enter. Try to make it easy as possible to type for the lazy of us. We are being carried. Look. We are. Like a boss. <laughs> With a boss like Maximo. <laughs> Let's see, will there be another DLC for Man Eater? That's a good question. Uh, and the answer is, we're keeping an eye on player appetite for more fights of Man Eater to enjoy. Uh, so obviously, uh, you've likely seen the DLC announcement for Man Eater Truth Quest coming a little bit later this summer. Uh, no, I can't share a more exact date with you just yet. Stay tuned to all of our usual social spaces for more on that as it develops. But I do believe we have more ideas to tell more stories in the world of Manny. Uh, I forgot. Hey, look, I'm back. To show the mods. <clears throat> That's not my gun. Where's my gun? That looks like my gun. You dying was hilarious. Do you think me dying was hilarious? I don't. That's not mine. Yeah, I'm trying not to pick up other people's guns so they're still out there but they look tasty so uh leviathan what are our plans for killing floor 2 uh we've posted a general outline of what's coming this year uh, including new maps new weapons new game modes uh check it out on the official forums at forums.tripwarinteractive.com and i'm sure we will start talking more about uh as the spring update comes to an end uh, what's coming later this summer? Everybody. Oops. Uh, what do I want? What do I want? Sonic resistance round sounds very useful. I do. Um, do I want another doom stick? Um... I've made some life choices, but I have much less weapon to carry out these life choices now. Oops. No, I was too slow. Special wave. Double special wave. Double specials. Earth, really fast. What does that mean? Very... Run for my life. They're fast oh my... or are fast? Much faster, and we all have massive waves, so good luck. Why, why do you do these things, Cruz? Because... Why are you two the way you are? Or the wall. <laughs> Has anybody ever told you that you're the reason we can't have nice things? Yes. Okay. Because they're right. Cruz, you're so fast. <laughs> I maxed out my uh, gunslinger, so I'm just speeding around. <laughs> and I think I got Spartan too from Zed. I'm also a Burke. Whee! Nice! <laughs> I'm trying to pop between different members of the party here. As the uh... oh, here come the ladies. That was a lot of stalkers that came around the corner. Okay. My weapons Just all have sure slow dead. reloads. This seems like a bad idea for this particular uh, horde wave. Angry bad man behind us. I don't believe he's there anymore. Okay. Um, I think he's been replaced by more angry bad men. Judging by the sound I hear. Oh. Oh. They're so that speedy. That was a freak on the floor. Um, does Scrakes belong on the dance floor? Um, they have some moves. Yeah. They can twirl. But they're not like Gorefast who spin to win, which we all know is the power move. Like, uh, yeah. Alright, Cruz. Important question. Can we spin to win like Gorefasts? 
Uh, well, if you make use of the DPI on your uh, mouse, <laughs> yes, yes, you can. Hand, I think you could. Okay. Uh oh, I'm low on health. I'm trying to put down a healing grenade somewhere over here. As I try not to crouch. I want to. That scrape straight up ran away from me. Well, I find myself out of that thing called ammunition. Um, Scrake, here, join the party. Very angry, doesn't like me. Thought you all should know. Oh, that know. was less of my, oh, my no. ammo. Well, I put some healing grenades down. I'll make that. <laughs> that is no also, way. Also, I did not die the first this time. That was Molly. Just point that out for the record. All right, that's my last healing grenade. What role does Tripwire have in the making of Chivalry 2? We are the publishers. So we're helping the Torn Banner team uh, and our friends over there with things like helping them with QA, uh, helping them bring the game to console simultaneously, uh, marketing, community, and all those wonderful things and partnering with them to help them make an even better game for you all to enjoy. I am now officially My out of all the ammo, so it's uh, <laughs> knifey time. My true color says, never realize how much gore is in this. I play with it lowered. Yeah, it's a beautifully gory game. And you can make it more gory if you want to. If you go into your configs and mess with the gore manager, you can really, you can really crank up the dead bodies. and. If you and don't like bits. your frame rates... You can you do. Like <laughs> you can do things, dangerous things. I used to. I used to have some crazy settings for um for stuff to last like forever, so I could just have like a pile. I remember trying to play in tight spaces so that they would just stack up, and then it was like you couldn't see the crawlers coming anymore. Let me try and get my loadout back. That. I don't by want that, by that, by that, Whoa, by that. Oh. Do I want a... I don't have any stuff left for that, but now I actually have two guns. Let's see if I can answer any more questions here in YouTube land. Um, Perks. Would a borrowed Gorefast blade need to be inserted into your arm, uh, into your own bone work? Um, I don't know. Uh, and I don't want to find out personally. Everyone healthy. Need the damage. Gotta crank up the damage. Memeville, uh, I have no information about um, any sort of updated soundtrack at this point. Uh, it's something I know the audio team continues to consider, but I don't have any news if it's something they're moving ahead with. Uh, from James Sorrell, are there going to be any more Vosh skins for some of the new DLC weapons? I don't know at this time. Uh, we kind of... But... I will say we are doing uh, some less free drop skins uh, and moving towards uh, some more uh, direct purchase and season pass stuff uh, just based on player feedback uh, and what they've kind of said, what they like, what they don't like. So we're, we're trying to optimize what we're providing to what people uh, will gravitate towards and also help us keep uh, going forward to going. Oh my, oh my gosh. That's a lot of... Angry things. Hopefully my grenades will help. They 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 did? Okay, yes, excellent. We're good, we're good. They're exploding. We have the advantage. Yes. Getting all the healy bits. Uh oh. Um Fancy Hands Hans is here. Thought you all should know. Oh cool. That is that is correct! There's also a giant crawler that I do not like. <laughs> Ow. They should not Never exist. Forget to that they can also get big as well as fast. My bad. You you forgot to mention that. You clearly forgot to mention did you, that. Seriously, did you see the size of it? I did not see the <laughs> crawler, but I'll take your word on it. Also, for anyone wondering, uh, yes, Bosses can and do spawn during the wave normally, so you could end up with a lot of bosses all at once. 
I feel like I have to go back to that. Has anybody ever said you're the reason we can't have nice things comment from earlier? Because I don't think that goes far enough anymore. I think you're literally a horrible person. <laughs> Some Highest people afraid. like pain. <laughs> I'm concerned that Hans is going to throw grenades I'm soon. Just... Uh, she he threw some at the beginning, but I haven't- Oh, oh wait, I think that's the new Hans. Hold on. This is not the same Hans, is it? I was going to say- No, it's not. What? Oh. <laughs> oh, I fell down. Well, Hans is coming Giant. to join you, so have fun- he No, is. he turned around. So I'm going to come join you. I mean, I didn't think about it. We can we can have as many medics as we want. Oh no. You can be a medic, and you can be a me ah taunts. Sorry. Well, it's only him now. Nope. Shoot him while he's down. Alrighty. Yeah, we actually did fairly decent oh, that round. We survived it. I don't think anybody died, did they? No. I don't think anyone did. Yeah, good job, team. You know what this calls for? What? No, no I almost... I thought about buying a minigun, but with my current perk loadout, that's probably not the right move to make. Um... I've not do? been using my medic grenade. I mean, uh, that sounds like you're doing it wrong. Should I add with this? Should I add some? some I feel that your perks and skills aren't so hot. We do have a reroll skills button that we added in the newest update. And it's very cheap, at least the first time, and you'll get half of your money back. So if you really want to switch it up, you always can. Then. Oh no! Okay, wait, wait, wait. No, no, I don't have a. Let's see. Uh, oh well. Univergenes eighty four. <laughs> uh, I don't have any new news to share about Maneater. Uh, but I'm happy to clarify anything for you that you might want clarification on. Uh, marketing team tends to get mad when I just go forth and announce things that they haven't decided are public yet. Can't break the cool news yeah. by ourselves. They, they get upset. Apparently there's plans, and we're not in them most of the time. Oh, although apparently, I think, did Switch pre-order go up yeah. today? Yeah, uh, Switch pre-orders have gone up today for Maneater. So if you've been looking to buy Switch, uh, buy Switch, buy Maneater for Switch, uh, today is your lucky day to get that pre-order in and there's an angry patriarch with a minigun. I'm putting down some healing grenades. Hopefully that helps. There's a lot happening here. There is. A lot to take in. Matriarch's here as well. Oh, Matriarch's here, guys. Uh, guys, were you not happy of having one boss? Here's two. We had the whole mom and dad are both here. Mom, dad, I just want to make you proud. I'm sure someone uh, in one of the chats mentioned Imagine Matriarch, so I'm going to blame them for this. Yeah. Um, uh -huh. This is why our fault for patting. Someone in chat says they love how customizable this um, this game mode is, and yeah, you you can, like I said in the beginning, you can um, set uh, wow uh, everything from a higher player count to where in the waves you want to start, how much dosh you get. There's. Um, how you want the weapons available and how you want all that to work. Like, it's crazy. We got a wave of flesh pounds coming in to uh, join the fun, just as a heads up. I'm putting down some. Yeah, that obviously hasn't helped you once again. <laughs> uh, I'm going to join Ek4 over here uh, and hope he'll save me. Can and air, we brought them together finally, the matriarch and the patriarch. And and what is she doing? She she's more annoyed with us 
Uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> this might be it for me. Come on. I'm hurting. There's one. I, I'm in a corner. Corners are bad. Corners, the number one killers in all the killing floor. Well, there goes Act 4. Oh, that uh, would be a... Someone said, isn't the matriarch supposed to be fighting the patriarch? Rachel hates her daddy. And I thought that would be a really cool experience to, like, fight through. Like, those two in, are in the map fighting each other, and you just gotta kind of survive and get out. <laughs> I, I could not uh, outlast the plasma beam. So, uh, Cruz, once again, Our... it's on you to carry the team. Our no, boss like a maximum is here, who is a noted carrier of teams. Oh, that hurts. <laughs> All right. Uh, Memeville, this is Zedternal Reborn, which is a custom mod for Killing Floor 2, available in the Steam Workshop. And we're here with, let's say, the community manager of Zedternal Reborn, Cruz, who is here to answer <laughs> all your questions and fail at carrying us through its many difficult twists and turns, as he often fails to mention them until, you know, they're in our face killing us. Well, surprises are the best. That's my <laughs> view. Uh, and those of you who Fun. might just be joining us, yes, make sure to type Armory in chat for a chance to win a season pass uh the armory season pass on steam uh once on twitch once in youtube uh, a little bit later in the stream there's a link in a chat to zed turtle i think i still have uh a link to share nope i can oh no when you're way Oh. Cruz, you're no, being chased. That. And you just barely got away from some rockets. No. That, hurt. that hurt real bad. That. I've linked a trailer uh, that Cruz provided us earlier. So you can check out the trailer for this game mode and let me pull it up real quick it was just a power team yeah Dang. and there is the steam workshop link for anybody who might want to grab it for now or even for later uh because once again we'll be rotating people in and out and you can join us and try and keep us alive though i will say uh doing so Poorly in the first round, I think really impacted our ability to carry through. Is that it? I uh, think we might want to go ahead on. and maybe go ahead and take this chance to to uh, bring in some new players. So if you can kindly hop out, so others can have a, a shot at playing it as well, that would be super helpful. Uh, Leviathan wants to know if it's possible to use control difficulty and Zedternal. Um, I would suspect no, uh, but I also suspect you don't need to because I believe Zedternal's fairly customizable. Uh, both of those are pretty much 100% accurate. You can't really combine Zedternal Reborn with other mutators. Uh, things get funky, especially since Zedternal Reborn itself has its own controller over the spawning system. But because it does have that, uh, using the Eternal Reborn config, uh, any file, you can absolutely adjust things pretty much to your entire whim. Uh, I know that some servers exist where they have it set up with special Zeds, other ones where the Zeds are just way more powerful. Uh, you could increase their speed and health and things like that. You can increase the amount of Zeds on the field at any one time. There's a lot of really in-depth customization, things that surprise us that the community do that we, as them, um, Fleet Killer's dev and me as the person who's trying to keep up with everyone else uh, just don't see coming. So I would strongly suggest if you're interested in trying it out to just go ahead and download it, launch the game mode at least once, and then the Zedron Reborn config will show up where your other configs tend to. 
Uh, James Terrell, I, I believe there was already a double XP event at the start of the spring event. So I believe that is actually mm -hmm. run its course. I do not believe we currently have another one planned uh, for this particular update. Uh, and for Universe Jeans, what new games do you guys think of making? We have many ideas. Some of them are even good, but we are restricted by the big three, time, money, and people to work on games. So we have to choose what we're working on uh, at any given time. Uh, obviously, our most recent internal focus has been on Maneater and its upcoming DLC, uh, while partners over at Saber have been working on keeping Killing Flirt 2 updated for us. Uh, and on the, you know, our publishing side, uh, we've got some great partners over at Torn Banner who've been making Chivalry 2. And perhaps we'll have some other cool excitements in the months and years ahead, both internally and from our publishing department, Tripwire Presents. So make sure to keep an eye out. And see what map got chose. Uh, no, I th I'm just... I think it might have been West London. I have not loaded in. Yeah, neither have I. Is the server okay? No. Oh. Did we break it? <laughs> see. Uh, and let's see. From Common Rider Kuga. Any chance for a story mode in Killing Floor? Um, at least as far as Killing Floor 2 is concerned, uh, there's no plans for a more fleshed out story mode. Uh, we trialed uh, objective mode uh, to try and tell more stories within the Killing Floor universe. However, just it wasn't getting as much player uh, love and attention uh, as we would like to see for us to keep putting resources into it for now. Uh, but I'm sure in the future we will look at what we can do on that front, uh, perhaps in other projects. Uh, like ah. Killing Floor Incursion, which is a single player VR experience. That tells a story. And I did not make it into the server. Server went down. Okay. Uh, Blaze Killing Floor Calamity is not coming to any new platforms and is not currently on sale on any platform. Uh, and I do not believe we have any plans to revisit that okay the bat that i updated did not work why it's a the server tool. It's okay. server tool. get the server back up and running i can't give any information about any projects uh meadow meadow uh outside of what we've already discussed publicly so right now, our focus is on supporting Killing Floor 2 uh, via our partners at Saber. And as I said internally, we've been working on Maneater and its upcoming expansion. So that is what the team is working on. And I am happy to talk about uh, what we've announced there. But uh, we are not the right people to talk about future projects because the marketing team gets mad at us when we do that. What do you want to know about the Man Eater DLC? I, I see several people uh, calling out. Uh, once again, I can only really talk about what we've announced so far, perhaps provide a little clarity, uh, but there are some things we want you, the players, to discover as you dive back into the waters of Port Clovis and figure out what's happening. I don't know what's happening. It won't let me... It won't let me edit the bat file. Or we have that or open it with the uh where was it you can try the management console yeah i can just uh start it and then with the tool hold on yeah uh why we wait for those who might not have seen it here's a trailer My name is Trip Westy. Recently, I produced the television nature series, Man Eater. Mm -hmm. Over the course of the film, our cameras witnessed unprecedented displays of evolution, 
strange mutations never before observed by the human eye. When I spoke to a prominent marine biologist, she claimed it was due to Port Clovis's extreme levels of radioactivity and industrial effluent. But I couldn't shake the feeling that she was merely trying to placate. What did she really know? And why wasn't she telling me? Then, as if the stars had all aligned, the former Q-level security specialist sat down next to me. What he told me would haunt me for the better part of a year and lead me back to Port Clovis on a dangerous journey uh, through dark secrets, government cover-ups, and a clandestine cabal of extraterrestrial elites single-mindedly determined to enforce their will on humankind. What? Come with me the on a quest for up. the truth. True oh, quest. Uh, help me, the server's full. Okay. So, Alex, uh, yes, the shark is getting bigger. And for those following along in chat, uh, you can read more news on the announcement of the DLC there and the link I just sent. I'm getting message that the server is up but full. Miss Male. All right, I'm bringing him back down. I think I'll be right back. Maybe I can do something else. Uh, I'll need to be dragged back in though. Okay. So, Man Eater is coming to Steam later this year. I do not have an exact date to share, uh, but. It should be showing up there in the coming months, and I'm sure we'll be sharing more on that uh, in the weeks ahead. I will say, um, I'm not, is, um, uh, Molly, do you know if the Epic, uh, sale is still going? Uh, uh, Cause I'm not sure. I think the Epic sale may have just it ended, is. but, uh, yeah, you may want to check if it's not, uh, Man Eater was on sale there. Uh, it's also, I believe just on sale on the Xbox, uh, starting today. Uh, so there are places if you're interested in picking up Man Eater, uh, where you can get a little bit of a discount. Okay. Uh, Barrett Kuda, uh, while Killing Floor 2 is long in tooth, uh, we plan to keep supporting it as long as it is viable to do so via our partners uh, who are currently Saber. Uh, so right now we've got a full plan of content through this year. And as we get towards the end of the year, we will evaluate where we're at and see where we want to take things next. And I think I saw a uh, message a little bit earlier that I wanted to touch on. Uh, we currently have no plans to revisit any Killing Floor 1 maps and bring them into Killing Floor 2. Uh, if you do play on PC, there are quite a few good player-made ports. Uh, but our team really wanted to focus on telling new stories via maps in Killing Floor 2 rather than revisiting some of the older ones from the original Killing Floor. And while we wait uh, for the server to come back up and be ready to go, uh, can you just... check. I pinged you somewhere. You? Can you check somewhere? it? Yeah. There should be a password to the server. Where did you ping me? Oh, over here. You've pinged me in like five places today. So sorry. That's how we work. I am. I'm trying the first word that you gave me, and it appears to have worked. I am loading. So. All right. I just want to make sure everybody gets in, and then I'll fix the. 
and I will update so I can share with uh, my site over here on Team YouTube. Um, let's see, I'm trying to answer more questions here while we have this opportunity. Um, currently, uh, Dr. Indy, there are no new plans for uh, updated seasonal uh, Zeds. So the current seasonals that you have are the current seasonals that will keep returning. Uh, but if that's something you want to see, feel free to join the conversation at the official forums. Uh, we are still actively looking at, you know, what players want uh, and how we can give it to them. Uh, but we're also tempering that against the size of the team and the amount of resources we have to go into the project. So some bigger asks are more unlikely to happen at this point in the game's life cycle uh, with more of a focus on uh, continued support around things that players love, like new weapons, uh, quality of life, balance issues, and things like that. Uh, there was another question. Okay, Cruz is Cruz is 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 in. Okay. So I'm gonna redo the um the image. All right, let me know when you're ready. I've updated mine, I believe. Um, I sorry, I didn't catch you. Oh, Meadow Meadow. Uh, there will be no uh platform update for Killing Floor Two for Xbox Series. X or PlayStation 5 uh, to bring Killing Floor 2 to a more native build. Uh, that's not something the team is planning to do at this time. Uh, but if you have a, play, a PlayStation 5 or an Xbox Series X or S, you can play the existing PlayStation 4 or Xbox One builds just fine. Okay, so I have changed the password. Uh, we can show it now. The new passport word is reborn. No cops. Don't forget, we also have the giveaway for the um, the pass, the armory pass, for all the DLC weapons uh, that are being released this year, as well as all the ones up to that. So type in chat armory. That's the giveaway keyword if you want to get entered into that raffle. And that is all lowercase. I'm rearranging all my tabs again. Hey, uh, I was in the server for a moment, and I did not see the words that were reborn on the left-hand side. Hello. Oh, oh, is it not? Yeah, it does not look like it is. Okay. We're not. We kill her. The mad lad that he is has already modified one of our servers to be pretty much exactly the same. So we can just hop over to that if that would make things simple. Uh, I am up for it. I guess doing that. Yeah. If they're able to. Okay. If you could DM me the um the uh, server info and uh, the password and stuff. I don't have a pass. Thank you. Argument. Yeah. Password it. <laughs> Otherwise, okay. we won't get in. All right. Uh, as uh -huh. you heard, everyone, uh, we're still working on getting the server set back up. Uh, Una momento, it looks, sounds like we're switching servers. I'll be I will right try back. and answer a few more questions along the way. So my apologies on this slight delay. Let me get that off the screen. Yeah, we're, we're not planning to play on normal. Uh, we are playing Zeternal Reborn. I have never played Zeternal. <laughs> no. Uh, this would be interesting. It is, it is certainly an experience, uh, as Cruz was showing us in uh, our past round. So... Yeah, well, we need help, apparently. We need more people to carry us. I remember seeing that turn a few years back to just, it just seems like chaos. He was. Mm hmm. But Barnes is just trying out the window, and you have like all the carry weight you can get, and plus three weapons is crazy. We're trying to get this back up. Were you in the... Did you make it onto the server series? Um, Before? 
because we're going to switch servers. So I will well, since you're... trouble getting to the other server, actually. Yeah. So I will yeah. I will send you info to get um how to get on the yeah next Grand. one. Funnily enough, today my uh, plush pound arrived. Oh. Uh, oh, nice. I wish I had mine, but uh, the one I had in my <laughs> car was actually stolen by a coworker uh, who saw it and demanded it from me um, when I was uh, leaving the office with it. So now I have to go grab another one. Yeah, uh, this this guy came really long way. I'm, I'm all the way over in Ireland. <laughs> they actually uh, got out pretty fast once uh, we yeah. announced that they were available for sale. Uh, for those who don't know what he's talking about, uh, we've partnered with Symbiote Studios. And we have some awesome plushies, uh, one plush pound for Killing Floor, and our man eater shark pup, for obviously man eater. And I will drop a link in chat as soon as I find that tab that I always have open. It's funny because it came like um, about a week after I got the bubble dozer from Payday, so I have uh, the two of the heaviest guys from Payday and Killing Floor. <laughs> nice. So, uh, yeah, it's cool to see them side by side. Isaac Gator, uh, Manator is coming to the Nintendo Switch, I believe, May 25th. Uh, please double check me on that. And I believe it went up for digital pre order today uh, for a lot of the regions. If you check out the Switch store eShop, uh, hold on, let me verify that May date for Man Eater Uno Momento as I check my own news. Remember, you can always get the latest news at the official forums where I post all this stuff. I got a picture of my cat snuggling up to the plush pound. My cat really Aww. likes uh, stuff toys, so I was like, yeah, plush pound, that'll, that'll, that'll help. So yes, it is May 25th for Maneater Switch Edition, uh, available on the eShop for pre-order today. Or at least starting today. You all good, Molly? Yeah. I think I got in. Um... Uh, do I have the info so I can get in? Okay. I just got it. And then, X4, can you share that with Sirius? And I will be right Thank back you. in just a short moment. Fine. Making it happen. Um, let's see. Thank you. Let me switch my wonderful. Code so I can give people the right information to join us momentarily. Uh, and I do believe my dog just farted next to me, so I just I wanted to share that with everybody. <laughs> Okay, let's well, see. All right, got that in. So that'll be ready to share shortly. Here, Lacey, come say hi. Because I know you like popping in all the streams. Come here. This is the queen of farts. Her name is Lacey. Hi, Lacey. We'll be sharing the IP and the password shortly so people can join us. Uh, we're just waiting for um, all of us to properly get in. Yeah. That's interesting. It's using, uh, is this a uh, mentally versus the way it's using the UI? Uh, no, it's custom mm. so so that um, extra players uh, show like that. All right. Yeah, so uh, the community team right. has uh, assistant puppies. Uh, for me, it is Lacey here. Uh, for Marley, uh, Molly, it is Charlie, the e eater of the internet. Uh, and for uh, Jen, our friend over at Torn Banner. Crap, I'm forgetting the name of her uh, Corgi Pop. But she's got a wonderful little Corgi Pop. All right. So I, I'm showing it. Okay, um, you're showing it? We're showing it? Yep. We're doing it live? Okay. Doing it live. I edited it live, actually. Oh, that that's the information you need to join us, everyone. 
Got a couple spots That's open still. Good. I remember when Killing Floor first came out, there were like modded servers that had like, I think 12 people or so on, and it was on suicidal, so you just hate flesh pounds chasing people for about 10 minutes straight. Yes. You mean flesh and pounds chasing like no a medic everybody. with an M79 in a katana for 10 minutes straight. Yeah. Oh, I remember uh -huh. those days. No, that was like back before like the Incinerate Detonate pack, it was like Burning Paris. I remember like on Burning Paris, there was that bug. Where you could crouch on the bollards, like the metal bo bo or not the concrete bollards around the street, and you could just crouch there, and the Zeds couldn't hit you. It's only sirens <laughs> to get you. Uh, there were, let's just say, a few exploits in a lot of the original <laughs> KF maps, uh, where if you knew what you were doing, especially with a double barrel shotgun, uh, you oh, could be, yeah. Yeah. you could exploit your way to victory. Which is not as fun. It I was mean, still funny though, just everyone squatting on top of the concrete bollards. I mean, yeah. I think it was I uh, remember... the manor house where you could get up on top of one of the sheds outside uh, and then nothing could hit you. Yeah. And getting six people up on there where it could barely fit two. I remember trying to do the boomstick jump on prison. Do you know that one catwalk in the middle courtyard that you can jump out of? You used to be able to boomstick jump up there. I haven't been able to do it recently. I don't know if that's been changed, but I remember being able to get up there. All right. I do believe uh, we've we've got our eight people if we're ready to go. We do. Just uh, a quick note. Uh, we reduced it from Hell on Earth to Suicidal. Oh. oh. They had pity on us. Why would you possibly do that? I mean, you know, yeah. it, it helps just kind of showcase the differences you know uh -huh, if you're okay. a little nice then the meanness comes out even better at the end <laughs> ah, okay okay you well, listen first. to a false sense of security and then... exactly. all right also i don't think we pulled off some of the other things we've done on our server so there might be a couple extra features like damage indicators that'll show yeah you. oh so we're we ended up with some of the same people from last time is there a way we can can we um boot people so we can get some new uh yeah. boss like was one unless that's fleet or something and i just don't know no. it okay was king was kinku also one i don't remember but i do remember boss like yes they carried us the one time and they did I and i appreciate that. it yeah we do want to get some new bodies in here. Ah, they, I don't have this password on hand. Let's see here. One second, one second. Unready, so if you many can. Pops. I think you had too many people. This might ready. be too late. Oh, I paused oh. at three seconds. Yes, please, boss. Like, we're trying to to uh, rotate. All right, we've got room for one more person. Putting that back up. Ah, there we go. Got it. All right, is there anyone else that needs to be removed? Well, Greg's got in fast. Um, I think that's it. Okay. Don't really remember. I missed some other than us. Sensitivity. I, that was the one that poor. Yeah, they stood out because they were so good. Because <laughs> they saved us. Oh, okay. Was that was that um, Omega? No biggie, Omega. We appreciate it. All right. Let's see if we can All do right. it now. This time for reals. For realsies? For realsies. We got oh my this. gosh, my my dog wants to be in my lap. This is not the time. This is serious, Charlie. Yeah, that's, that's how dogs work. I don't, I don't know if you got serious. the memo. We're not doing the... Oh, I'll put the game back on. Uh, Rising Storm 2 fix, question mark. Uh, we uh, hope to have an update out, to which is the final update, quality of life update for Rising Storm 2. Uh, in the coming days slash weeks, 
Um, it's sooner rather than later on that front. Uh, I don't have any news to share just yet, uh, but I expect that will change shortly in the coming days. Uh, so just stay tuned to our socials and uh, should have more there. I know the QA team has been going over the builds uh, and verifying the fixes, verifying uh, all the new stuff, uh, which is a new map, making sure that's uh, it, where we want it to be. Uh, I'm just kind of waiting for them to tell me when it'll be ready, when it'll be done with its testing, and uh, get a uh, changelog that I can share with the team. Well, not the team, share it with everybody out there on the internet. Could we have spawned any farther? <laughs> uh, yes. We got, like, the furthest spawn. Alright. Was... I don't want a minigun. Okay. You know what? I want a uh, minigun. In fact, I have a minigun, and you can't stop me. Wow. Minigun for maximum pleasure. All right. Um, let's autofill that. Oh, we have some precious weapons. I will definitely take a precious Tommy gun. Well, I'm going to uh, rank up my commando because I'm come obviously like... living the minigun life. Do those come uh, with any extra stats already on them? They or do they indeed. Just... They are more expensive oh. than they come with better stats across the board that's you cool can, hmm. i didn't realize that that's mm. yep. all right okay okay do, 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 do. My, i'm making some life choices here with my mini okay, gun so i want some more <laughs> i need more bullet and faster bullet for my mini gun Oh, my rerolls did me yes. poor. Oh my goodness, all my weapons can put Zeds on fire now. Amazing. Uh, equipment upgrade. I will get that gas mask ASAP. Alright, now I can buy more ammo for my minigun. I like that I can buy... I like that I can buy, um... I've got oh, my medic grenade. Night mission. Oh, I forgot Night Vision has mask. not been in the Tower Born until this update, so we were like, let's add it in. Do it! And then immediately some questions we got were like, how do you use Night Vision? <laughs> uh, Excellent. You put it on your eyes, I've been told. For anyone who doesn't know, you hold the flashlight button and it toggles on your Night Vision. And I can't show it because I didn't buy it. I just have a flashlight. This is like, oh my god. I don't even... This is like being a kid in a candy store. Yeah. Um, let's see. <laughs> Where are we going to hold out? This hallway? Oh, cool. Another horde around. Yeah. Oh, double. Um, double horde. Division! Oh, boy. That's... Okay, we need to get out of here. They're all oh, going to spawn a second They're going to split? Them. Okay. Yep. Kind of like... Don't... I think we're going to get wiped right now. So I see your this server also has the damage indicators on. Yeah. That's cool. Yes. And you might have also noticed that there was uh, four Z buffs instead of three when we came in because we like things a lot harder on our servers. So. Oh my that, gosh. That's why we dropped it down to suicidal. I was going to say you realize it was the two Z bosses that murdered us last time. You think? Uh, our servers are kind of set up if I remember correctly, to basically have everything spawn in as fast as possible. And they won't teleport, so they'll just be a massive horde, which is what's currently <laughs> happening right now. <laughs> None of that silly 32 max on the field. Uh-uh. Hmm. Some of us have to be concerned about performance on low-spec machines. That <laughs> is true. That yeah. is not what this mode is for. <laughs> Yeah. We have done a lot of work optimizing the code to help with that, actually. That's, for example, the uh, Zetron Reborn upgrade menu in itself uh, used to mostly have everything in one or two tabs, and we realized that if we spread it out, it would make things a lot easier on people when it came to um, ah, cool. updating information on their computers. Nice. Well, so oh, far, so Team Minigun uh, has served me well. Do you have a minigun wall over there? Um, sure, if that's what you want to call it. I have a wall of bullets that come from my minigun. Oh, I didn't know if, if you had like a 
minigun buddy over there or <laughs> something too. I mean, I wish I did. Oh. There's oh, I keep forgetting they split. Yeah, there's a small little guy right here who's beating on me. I shall ask him with bullets to go away. I walked in the, the uh... Oh, there's a guy stuck in the vent. Thing. Is that a vent? No. Yosh, if I give you all my money, will you buy a bunch of, uh... What's up there? Sharpshooter upgrades? Um, I could, yes. There a reason you want me to buy sharpshooter upgrades? Because with the miniguns, since uh, all since the majority of the perk upgrades in Zetron Reborn don't apply only to a sharp weapon, you can mm -hmm. basically turn the minigun into a one-on-one -on -one targeter. Okay. With no recoil. I will uh, explore this opportunity that you have uh, presented to me. It's the, an option. Uh, last bad seems to be stuck outside the map. Uh, yeah. If there is, do not worry. They'll get killed and respawn shortly. So, not a problem. Small and shiny. Or I could just kill it myself. Let me see. I keep seeing it for a second. There it is. There. Problem solved. Oh no, stats are turned off. How am I gonna level up now? <laughs> <laughs> kill it. Okay. So... Perk menu, and you said I want to go sharpshooter, right? Yeah, just grab a couple of sharpshooter. You don't have to use all your money. But um, each time you do it, you'll have 8% less recoil with any weapon. I mean, I'll take it. Increased range of firebug weapons. Attack and shoot 15% faster with all weapons. Well, I do believe I'm at the end of what I can do for yeah. now. Let's see if there's any questions I can answer while we're here. Uh, when can we pre-order Truth Quest DLC? Uh, we don't have a date to announce just yet on that front. Um, as soon as we know, we will announce it. From Core Jake, thoughts on Unreal Engine 5? Uh, I know a lot on our team are looking forward to playing around with it uh, and learning what it can do. Ah, oh, did I actually spend all my money? <laughs> uh, from I actually Chickletoes. spent all my money. Uh, the shark in the image, is it uh, wildlife or an evolution set? That's a good question. Perhaps. You should tune in to Man Eater Truth Quest to find out more. To get to the truthiness of it all. Uh. I'm a little bloody. Just a little bit. So what do we got? Crawlers are faster, Zeds have more health. Zeds have more health, Zeds have more, more damage, damage. More aggressive. And more aggressive. And slasher are enraged. Crawlers slashers, are faster. Slashers always <laughs> have to be more enraged. Alright, are we holding Ghost out here in the, the courtyard? There's quite a few uh, entrances here. Oh, there's a holdout. The banana, or... Woo! Oh dear. Now nah, I really wish to bought a minigun. <laughs> I am in the zone. Oh god, the bone crusher swings so fast now. I was gonna say, is there any use in welding a door shut? I I don't think so, no. Okay, I'll I don't know if we have a demo. Not well, you'd here. have to unlock door trapper. Yeah. Oh, is, is that a uh, RPG, I see? I got it. <laughs> I think that's Greg's dead. My bullets say zero damage, so I'm assuming that's Greg's dead. <laughs> Can't take anymore. Just stop it. That's a really big strike. Never mind. Oh, oh, a, a couple strike. of them. 
I'm gonna say, uh, crouched with a midi gun, uh, pretty on point. Though I hear I should turn around from all the screaming behind me. Yeah, it's getting a bit pushed in back here. Well, my door is pretty open. Two. M maybe you should have invested in more mini guns. Really should have. Dual wield mini guns. I'll just have to upgrade the damage on my Tommy Precious. Here, I'll throw some health out. <laughs> oh my goodness. Comes a couple more uh, Two purple eyed scrakes. Uh, also, some flesh pounds. Oh, quite okay. a few. Ooh. It hurts. It hurts. I mean, it always hurts. That's their secret. <laughs> oh my gosh. Almost everyone has more armor than. I sense. picked up someone's 500. What's armor, guys? You don't need that to wave seven. Wait. Wave 17 or wave <laughs> seven? Seven. Just all right. In like an average game, you mean? Yeah. Okay. Not, I thought you meant here. I was just like, oh. uh, sure, yeah, the logic probably has zero meaning here. Going. Where am I going? Not here. There's armor here in the locker. Thank you. Oh, uh, when do you want to do the the giveaway? Should we do it after this? Yeah, let's do it after match. the yeah after this match. That seems fine. After this match, we'll do the uh the giveaway on both streams. Okay. Um, buy some medic upgrades here. Just because I've got some medic grenades. Um, what does that do? I'm just gonna look at perks. That seems useful. Generate ammunition while you heal. That seems useful. That's very useful. That seems useful. Alright. Oh, deluxe. Ah, you reached the end of the perk tree. What'd you get? Said explosion deluxe. Ooh. I don't think I have enough money for it. I'll, I'll, I'll fund that. I will fund that. Uh, we've got two keys for am, the Arsenal season I am the uh, cyber foster. We're giving away one on Twitch, one here on YouTube. If you you're gonna have to exit the menu and go back to. Oh, you're right. Arsenal here in chat. You will be entered to win. Uh. Yes. Universe Jeans, I don't have a good answer for how long we've ever survived because this has been the first time Molly and I have played this mode uh, in a long, long time. So I don't. This, yeah, this is the really longest. Remember. You are watching the longest we've ever survived uh, as it happens. Does uh, playing reload speed give you the delete animations eventually or is it just the uh, artificial speed up? How's everyone doing? What? Does buying the reload perks uh, give you the speed up, or does it give you the elite animation? Uh, oh, for the uh, quick reload perks, I'm yeah, not yeah. quite sure which animations are used, but That's there a are. That's giant crawler. So, I mean, some of them I know definitely just speed up because it doesn't function otherwise. Like yeah. there aren't any. Uh, I don't think there are any quick reloads for things Certain like weapons, yeah. Like the RPG and things of that nature, but it will just speed it up. So no matter what, you will get your quick reload. I like quick reload on the uh, minigun the most because it's just slapping it a couple times and then you have ammo again. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that how these things work? I mean, you just hit a computer and it starts working, right? So why wouldn't that work for a gun? I mean, if you, you beat it with a hammer and it works, five. you're doing it right. HK slap. Um, Alpha Omega wants Cruz to explain what Omega Zeds are. 
All right, Omega Zeds are special versions of seven of the normal Zeds in Vanilla King Floor 2. And they have special abilities, which range, and special abilities is extra damage. They look a little bit different. They got giant purple glowing eyes to make it easier for you to spot them. And they're just generally really dangerous. Uh, some examples are the Flesh Pound oh. Omega, which will just uh, launch itself at you and ground Wait, pound and explode. Matrix? Oh, yes. Matrix! You did hear Maddie. Oh, yeah, I see the plasma. Trying to melt somebody. Quite guys. Too. Ow. She decided we shouldn't have armor. Uh, these Omega Husks over here, they have a mortar attack, oh. similar to the Patriarchs, except That's they shoot mortar. I That's saw the... I saw that I thought someone was trying to do something I didn't approve of. Uh, we, just, we just saw a husk do the mortar attack on my screen. Oh, we got double bosses now? Yeah, Hans Volker in the round. Uh, oh boy, well, that hurts. There's a matriarch yeah. right here. Yep. I and went the wrong way. I don't think there is a right way at this uh, particular moment in time. We Just... should probably maybe leave, yeah. Yeah, I... Riding is the better part of Valor? Uh, shoot backwards. Congratulations. You picked the winning move. Not to play. The secret Eric. technique of running away. I put some health down. Uh, somebody back there, Ooh, Molly, Eric. of course, <laughs> is going to die again. <laughs> oh, what alarm is going on? I have just a, you know, triple sized huge crawler here. Let's get rid of that. Where's all the ammo? Alright, I'm trying to hold. Oh, Hans is coming. I'm curious how many people in I the chat have, shields. have already heard of Zed Turnal or have played it before. I've heard of Zed Turnal, I've never played it until now. Oh, that's cool. Ooh, first time. What do you think? <laughs> how does it make you feel inside? <laughs> On a scale of 1 to 10, how much counseling will you need after this? That's what I was going to say. Can you show us on the scare model of your flesh pounds where it hurts you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for those um, who just joined us, we're doing Zedternal. That's the name of the like, mod. And here Zedternal is Reborn, specifically. Like Yes. Three and a half thousand so hours eternal reborn. I have to make eternal. myself keep saying reborn because I forget. You're very bad at it. Especially the card piece. If you want the children. Okay, skill upgrades. Any skill upgrades that are worth buying? No. I think we're fine for now. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it looks like folks in chat, there's quite a few that have seen it or seen it mentioned. I got 44 people who entered into the contest uh, over oh, here. Oh, yeah. Let me let me do my stuff and then... Oh, I forgot I had to buy all new. Oh, no. Um, okay, what's that? Oh, I'm really poor. This is scary. How poor okay. are you? I only have forty bala dollars, so I have like two hundred seventy if anyone needs it. Either you <laughs> sure you got that? I've got four hundred. I mean, it's not a I'm lot. I'm just trying to put more ammo in here. Yeah. Thanks. I okay, I got some... ammo. Oh, now I can also have. Some oh, gritty my bucks. Gosh, I keep forgetting. I need to use my grenades. Yes. Thank you guys. They're useful. So, uh, quick Thank pro you. tip for anyone who might be interested in playing Zeternal Reborn on a server. If you go ahead and just uh, set all of your server browser settings to just reset and blink, and then uh, go ahead and cycle it via game mode, Zeternal counts as in any game mode, so any servers that might be running it will just pop up at the top of your server browser, making it easy peasy to locate one. I picked up a Winchester. I don't know if it's just a level spawn or someone dropped it. Is easy peasy a technical term? Yes. Okay, just check. I'll make sure to have Flea Killer put it into the margin notes. Look at us! Write that down. Um, big bad angry man coming out of doorways with purple eyes, and I don't like it. Also, they were going to revive. Yay! Define revive. Uh, what? Name, trolley. <laughs> it's Phoenix, so they'll just revive. That's a lot of them. I'm, I'm concerned. Are you saying they have Phoenix down somewhere in the party? 
Did they just spring back oh. to life? Look, there he is. Oh, that's a king flash mm. pass. He did a spin to win. Oh, oh we got a king. Oh, dear. Okay. I have a question, because I have to ask, because so yeah. far, you seem like one of two duos who hate people and want to punish them with bad life choices. Um, is friendly fire an option in this game mode? Absolutely. I'm pretty sure you could just go ahead and set that up like you normally would. Okay. Although, even we haven't done that. We do have a friendly <laughs> fire server, but that's uh, for vanilla. It's with that last, <laughs> you think. But you give me an idea now, and I'm gonna have to push it. I'm just saying. What about? Okay, I'm just saying. What about a surprise friendly fire wave? Is that possible? Ah! I've been melted. Whoa! What the hell was that host shot? Uh, our friendly fire sets to twenty-five percent. I just saw like a mortar host shot. That was crazy. Yes, that would be the omega husk. That was yeah. Which also melted me because I got too far away from everybody. Cheap. Luckily, I dropped all my weapons. Have you tried asking the Omega Husk, firmly but politely, to go away? I th I I did not, and that is a good point. Politeness will get you very far in life, and I should have okay. tried to do that to stay alive. Now, now this the follow-up. This looks really bad. <laughs> can I throw Shooting money? Can, can I throw money at the enemies to make them go away? And I think I'm going to die here. I'm throwing down my grenades. Oh my gosh. If I have oh, any, I have yes. Ammo. Here, guys, have some healing grenades, because I don't believe I will survive the day. Feels right. Oh, we got one it. Of we the got it. Code devs has died. Everyone else lives. Is this how you feel all the time, Molly? What? What? Hey, I lived. I lived. The winner is me. By running away. Wow. That's that's how you win in life, kids. Run away. You just run away from all of life's little problems, yeah. Just keep running, man. True true life advice Can't brought to you. By the Tripwire community team. Exclamation point. No advice offered here is professional. Are valid. We just have one armory to give away today. Um well, next time. Have... We have one. Well, per... one one per one per stream. Yes. So one on um, Twitch, one on YouTube, uh, and they are Steam keys today. They uh, are we're Steam hoping keys. In the future, we'll be able to add some more platforms, uh, but we we were able to quickly acquire some Steam keys to share with you all. Yeah, but yes, like you said, in the future we will have more to give away and more platforms. Ooh, I managed to get Pyromaniac. Um, we shoot with unlimited ammo and 20% faster whenever I'm surrounded by four more Zeds. That seems useful. Yeah, I would have liked that a little while ago. Yeah, it might have been helpful. Uh... What did we make it to? 19 or 20 last time? I don't remember. Uh, I think this is the furthest sure. we have gotten to, so... I think we only made it to like 16, 17 last time. Brings too many memories. Where are we going? Are we coming out here? We've split the party. This is never a good sign if I've learned anything about this mode. Molly, you bought I mean, no it's... armor. Yeah, I laugh at armor. I've you, no. No right. I laugh in the face of armor. Ha ha. Ha ha. Aha! No, I want to do it more like. Aha! I just don't know what armor is. Aha! <laughs> All these movie remakes just keep getting worse. <laughs> wow! Okay. Oh. I'm tired. Ninja Strike! Ninja Strike! I understand why I should have had some armor now. Oh, Maybe upgrading all your weapons. I'm trying to strike on the kill feed, yeah. I'm just holding my lane. Ow. Never mind. I'm just dying in my lane. Goodbye. Oh. The hell. Goodbye. Uh, oh. Yeah. All I of a sudden a there were grenade on your dead body. Did that uh, help? Sure. Just all of a sudden there were several scrakes and a flesh pound and they weren't happy with my life choices. Holy crap. Right. 
because I died. Here is your last chance to enter into our armory pass because I'm about to pull the trigger. If you have not yet done so, type armory, all lowercase, into that chat here YouTube on YouTube. Stream. This is the YouTube guy, me, Jared Yoshiro, talking. Molly oh. will give away her key momentarily as well, but I am the one what giving are you away saying? my key I'm right dying? now. No, I can't see that. All right. I am pulling the trigger in five, four, Our three, is gonna, oh, two, no one. He got killed. one. Is Han Zag Zag Zagadka in chat? Hold on. That's a big crawler. Just keep making circles. Oh, dude, that's it. Okay, yeah. Oh, this, oh, oh, this might be the end. Shot that. That's not the way. <laughs> click, click, oh, click. Holy crap. Oh, no. yep. yeah, punch yeah, a hole. Yeah. Which way are yeah. you? Just punch a hole. Oh my gosh, our medics are doing so much work. Trying to decide which way to scooch through here. Nope, not gonna make it. <laughs> Heels. <laughs> um, uh oh. All right, I guess this is your last chance on Twitch. Let's let's move through this uh, narrow Go hall ahead. before they bunch up. Uh, enter in armory, the keyword armory, for a chance to win an armory pass. For killing floor two on steam which gets you all the weapon dlc for 2020 including those that are not released yet as well as all the weapon dlc that has been released thus far this is for steam I'm gonna check on Mubot. Show me the giveaway. Well played. Hard is open. Time for right. No point in saving, ladies and gents. All right. Uh, Pond, oh my gosh. I will get that to you uh, momentarily. I am, I guess, currently trying to uh, survive another uh, round. Yeah, I was about to pull the trigger. But, um, where did I die? Let me at least try to grab my weapon. Died over here somewhere. No, I died behind the truck. Anyone need a weapon? Truck, truck, truck. Not that it'll have ammo. If you need a weapon. Maybe this was a poor decision. Um, apparently... Anyone need a weapon? I can't pick up my gun. Oh, there we go. Got it. Got my gun, got my gun. Uh, take you... We all just got a lot of extra money, uh, but that's also because a bunch more Zed buffs just got thrown in. That seems terrible, considering I got every an time. Here. There are weapons all over the place over here. <laughs> so. Oh, this is an extended amount of time. That's excellent. Have you bought armor this time, Molly? Uh, I'm gonna buy it first. Did. Uh, who do I want? Can't buy the. Can I do? Who else? What else should I put money into? Or pyro, if I have pyro stuff already. Uh, Firebug and Berserker tends to give you some resistances to specialized attacks. Uh, SWAT will give you a bunch more armor. So that's not. Survivalist will give you weight capacity if you want to just carry a bunch more weapons. And then Medic oh. will let you heal better. Oh my gosh, I want to hold all the things. Do you though? Oh, I probably didn't. That's fine, I'll take this. 
<laughs> Alright, where are we holding out? Rojo is only level 9. Are there like traditional boss ways right. or just well, as this starts? Ways? I'm doing the drawing. That's gonna end well. Uh, I'll see your question really fast. Uh, there are no traditional boss waves, bosses uh, will just as you go, and you'll end up with shark 252 and a bunch of other numbers. Are you here? And not that I can actually see the answer. Oh, they are! I can see. You did. Okay. Next chance I get, I will whisper you the the key for this. Oh, crap. That mortar is serious. Holy crap. I'm getting... Oh, my God. I'm... The bone crush is doing work. Oh, that's a lot of mortar. That's a lot going on over there. Yeah, that's kind of a lot of mortar. Oh, I forgot I had medic. Yeah, you should do something about that. I'm afraid to punch a hole into these guys because there's a lot of husks. Did you, um, did you get a whisper? It's Moobot's acting like you can claim it, so I don't know if you need an exclamation point claim. I mean, I can enter it, but I mean, I can. Whoa! Uh oh, I fell off. It seems like a poor life choice, all things considered. Excellent death choice, though. Yeah. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. 15 health. I'm okay. Thank you. Ah! Oh I fell off gosh. again. I really should stop doing this. Backing off of walkways, my new uh, special skill. Said thank you for the health and ran straight into more Zeds. Well, you're uh, not really using that health unless you lose it, right? Yeah. Almost out of and we're getting pinned again. <laughs> this uh -oh. is fine to move, I think. Holy crap. Uh, I don't know which way to run. Yeah. Oh god, we're surrounded. Towards the fire. Yeah, I'm going towards the fire. We've moved more. I think we should have moved. I'm shooting backwards. I am, I am out of a... Uh... <laughs> there, this friendly flesh pound is helping me run faster. I hate you. Uh, that husk is going to the moon. Joe 2 in the, the YouTube chat asks, how do you level up perks in this? That might explain why. Level 9. Uh, the, basically, the way you level up is once you go into the trader pod and purchase your randomly selected weapon, uh, you can then close it and the Zeptron Reborn upgrade menu will open. In that menu, if you go into the perks section, you can select perks to purchase based on how much money you have, and then the skills section will be slowly unlocked as you buy a perk level. Each perk level generally gives you one skill, and then you can go ahead and purchase things from there. Oh, I lost my, uh... No. Probably out there somewhere. Oh well, I'll get another one. I should buy a um, if quick question, if I upgraded my weapon through the perks um, menu and I lost that weapon, but then I buy another one, was it were the perks that I upgraded for that weapon on the weapon or? That's a good question. I think the easiest way to find out would be to just buy it and then throw it on the ground. And if it's changed its color, you know it's upgraded, I think. Sell this then, and I'm sorry that I don't know that off the top of my head. That's okay. And then uh, Rojo followed up with, "When you reroll, does it lower?" Your... If you're watching my stream while you're in this trader menu right here, this is the perk menu button. 
a pick that brings up the extra stuff for the Zeternal Reborn mod. You did it! What was I going for? Wait. Oh. Um, but uh, as far as the uh, reroll is concerned, no, it does not change your perk level. It will only affect the skills. So if you've bought six levels and you reroll, and all the skills that you would have unlocked at that time will get rerolled for that perk tree. If you bought some, you'll get refunded. I think currently we have it on 50% refund, and each time you reroll, the price will double. So it'll go from 400, 800, 1600, dosh, so on and so forth. Hmm. Woohoo! Let's not stay in this tiny little spot. Why, why wouldn't we do that? <laughs> why are we still here? Oh, I'm suspicious of the fact that it's a low wave count. Yeah. We should try to get to wave 255. Alpha Omega says if you upgrade a weapon and sell and buy back, we'll keep those upgrades. I am inclined to believe them as they do play Zentron Reborn a lot. Okay, that's kind of what I thought. Because then when I rebought one, I wasn't offered that, um... I wasn't offered to do it again. That makes sense. Like There's an angry abomination type creature here who wants to say that's hello. That's just an, abom an abomination, it's not just a type. <laughs> I would say it was it's tier two abomination, tier two at least. Tier two, if you will. He's dead. Yep. Yep. There's gonna be more bosses based off of the low wave count. Just the one. Oh, I'm sorry. I meant to give you your thing, shark, that wave, and I was so intent on. Hope you're still here. Hello, Drake. I see you were a friend. Oh! Flash Pound King. This is King Flash Pound, right? Oh, he's got. Yeah, he no! just came barreling through. He was like, but you didn't see me. Whoa, okay, I nearly got blown up by a hook. Oh, that was me. I but... found your King Flesh Pounce. <laughs> Would somebody like to take him okay. back? While that's happening, I'm gonna give a shark their goodies. I still need to figure out how to send a PM in new YouTube. Apparently it's changed since the last time I did it. Oh, I'm not sure. Yeah, I might need to ask my wonderful winner, uh, Pan, to uh, contact me on another social platform and just confirm you are who you are. <laughs> oh, that wasn't too bad. Alright. Yeah, Pan, uh, contact uh, me via the official forums, uh, our Twitter, uh, and just confirm your username and chat and I will follow up. If that's good with you. Oh my gosh, your name. Hold on. Best way to... I really hope we get the special crawler wave at some point. Special the way you phrase wave. that makes me scared. I mean, what is it, agoraphobia? Right, is that the one? If you have that, I would not have fear of outside, like outdoor environment, I believe. Arachnophobia. Arachnophobia, yeah, that's it. Oh, need that again. I was looking at C4 and I thought, oh, funny, there are pipe bombs. Oh. 
Thank you, Max Fry. We agree that having Gary Busey as our Santa was an excellent addition. That was pretty funny. I loved him in Point Break. With Keanu Reeves, the original Point Break, not the new one. There you go, Shark. Enjoy your weapons. <laughs> Use them responsibly for the greater good. Of being on a friendly fire server? Is that the greater good? Alright, this isn't going to go well for me since I didn't really go to the trader. Good job. But that's not the first <laughs> no, time that's happened to you. You have no, no excuse. Right. Oh boy, what's happening? I'm um, oh, giving away the world is shaking. armory. Oh. Hey, hooray. Are we going to the zone? I'm not. All right, I like well. to live. Objective dot 666. Who wants to live? No, when you figure out what Earthquake is doing. Or think you have. Will there be tsunamis? That would be pretty cool. But well, I don't think that would be practical. <laughs> <laughs> that would be cool. Alas. Oh my goodness. We put like a JPEG that just kind of wipes across the screen into the. <laughs> is it knocking the Zeds over? Right! It's Earthquake is... periodically knocks all the Zeds to the ground. I was gonna say, is Trip. this helpful? Trip! <laughs> I almost I mean, didn't believe it, because it was helpful. Yeah! We, well, we got infinite ammo on wave too. Oh, bad. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, it's like when Patriot puts an all clout wave. I'm just living by um, a medic. I like to think in Endless when the Patriarch sends an all clot wave, he's just scrambling for time. Ah, I just got sent sideways. Like maybe the uh, delivery truck just got delayed or something. Yeah, he's like, oh, the next shipment, the flesh punch isn't here yet. Here's a bunch of clots. Hey, look, we've made it to the holdout zone. Good job, oh, everyone. <laughs> just like we planned. We got pushed That's right a... where we didn't want to be. That's an alarming amount of sirens. I say keep going through it. Was that an intentional pun? An alarming yeah. amount of, okay, okay. It, it, was, it was pun intentional. I, I enjoyed that, and I'm glad it was intended. <laughs> Give that pun a 10 out of 10. I got a big smile on my face, I'm waiting for the applause. No, okay. Yeah, no, I, I'm sorry, my, my finger is too busy holding down mouse one at the moment. Yeah, I was about to say, I'm just spamming at stuff, trying to hug blue gas. And you're you're asking out. for too much for a round of applause right now. <laughs> I'll be here on that. Clap, 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 Nah, I probably clap, won't clap, be. People clap, won't clap, be clap, clap, clap. Here, I'm going to do something terrible and help uh, my winner over on YouTube. I'm just pretending that I'm contributing. With my Winchester. <laughs> I'm terrified, but if Holy I just crap. get close enough to the Zeds, I'll get Emma. But they're all flash oh. I don't like that. I'm not quite dead yet, but I'm about to be. Oh! Oh, Tried. oh dear. Uh, Rojo, Roko Joe too. Has oh, all what the hell? My health is freaking no. upright. <laughs> oh god! Uh, they asked, uh, can you level up past the max of six perk upgrades? Yes, you can. You can go ahead and change that in the Zetor Reborn config any file and add more lines and you'll get more upgrades. Currently, we have a total of 10 possible. <laughs> Skills. Uh, actually, a lot of people are asking if they could have more than one uh, deluxe, so we actually added that in the most recent update. So you can also change it to have 10 deluxe. So if you really wanted to be OP, you can have 10 level ups, 10 deluxe skills, and make it all a dollar, and then just come in here and disintegrate everything. That oh, there's nothing to carry it worth. I was going to say you're trying to steal my was... gun. Did somebody steal my gun? No, I was going to try to bring some of the more expensive ones over, but I got all bunch of starter weapons. Oh, wow, another dust jacket out in the world. I haven't seen one of since 2016. I'm gonna take that Zen pistol, though. Right, I got my minigun back.
Yes, I'm thinking I might need a metal cod piece. Thank you. A little bit of helpful advice from the trader for me. Alec asks what the name of this mod is. It is Z Eternal Reborn. Z Reborn. The Steam Workshop. And yeah, if you do ex if you're in Twitch and you do exclamation point current mod, there's a link to it. Let's see. Uh, maybe I'll get some more. Oh, I'm poor. I won't get nothing. Uh, who's Winchester? Did I pick up? Uh, it was probably mine. I was just shuffling back. I was trying to shuffle back weapons that were dropped, but there were a lot of tier ones over there. And I ended up bringing them instead. Right. Bear has 235 armor, i just like to point out. Who does? Pop a bear bot. Nice. Uh, Carolina, this is what we call our community game night, where we usually pick a triple R game and play it with the community. Uh, today, we are playing Kill and Flare 2, and we're playing uh, Zeternal Mod with one of the people who helps make it uh, as their community manager. Named Crew. You can also call me the uh, test. What, a QA? Yeah. Yeah, QA. QA. Just community all the, dozens of time all, all the stuff uh, no one no one followed you, me you're the party that doesn't do the coding you break the code exactly so is there an easter egg that you inspired hidden somewhere in this mod no not yet i kind of want that to be a thing at some point but we're still pretty busy adjusting things right now um we're looking at trying to do some typo work with the skills and setting up the wiki on our community discord. So there's still a lot to do until we can get to the comfort of... I didn't, I didn't like oh, anything kill. that was happening Hold right on. there. Yeah, um, there's some angry bad men and fire and I'm dead. Yes, uh, Carolina, this is a mod. Uh, do I still have the... Hold on. Let me... Provide a link to chat because I've died again. I was trying to get over to Paper, who doesn't seem like. Well, he's having a tactical retreat here with Greg's and the rest of the team, but. I didn't make it. Pleasant experience, okay? Too much flesh pound. I don't know how I died there, but I survived. The other did, wave, which is a tier one weapon did, and no did, armor. Did you die before <laughs> me? Is the important question. Oh, maybe. Oh uh, dear! Oh dear! Probably. Oh dear! Come on, paper bot, paper bear bot. I believe in you. I I now get his name because he is a robot dressed in paper armor and he has a bear head. <laughs> he is committed. Nice. To his he lifestyle. Has. I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, Pan, uh, I will check the forums for your message. Holy crap. <laughs> I've been split off from the group. I'm gonna have to run right around. Uh, Pan, please find uh, in about five seconds your code. <laughs> Buddy, we gave it away. I did it, guys. I gave away a code. Okay. Woo! And thank you for joining the conversation over at the official forums. Stick around. Oh, oh, oh. It is a great place to reach us and let us know your thoughts, feelings, concerns, and all that other good stuff. And that goes out there to anybody in chat. You can join us at forums.tripwireinteractive.com to chat about any of our games. Oh, dear. Oh, there's a lot coming. This is getting insane. They're angry. Uh, Carolina, no. Uh, you have to play on a server with the mod installed or choose to activate it in solo play via command line launch. Uh, 
Otherwise, it will not impact uh, your standard play, and it will not impact your perks in any way. I remember I saw that a, will... uh, I remember I saw a mod that added a bunch of monsters from uh, Half-Life 2 into Killing Floor a while back. It was pretty yeah. impressive. There, yeah, it's scary. I'm running Half around with a town on me. Yeah, I thought it was pretty cool, like Proof of Contest add new monsters mod. Monsters are kind of hard from mm. a modding perspective. Some people have updated them so that they work. Um, usually, though, you'll find older mods that don't work unless someone's tinkered with them on their own servers. So it is possible to add different Zeds into uh, Zetron Reborn. And different guns from a uh, gun mod, such as the Halo Reborn. Halo, oh, I did uh, see the Halo mod. That was pretty cool. Yes, that one works totally fine. Chili Chillax, um, the giveaway, What you just missed it. We used Moobot and um, we used bots and did the raffle with a keyword. All right, everyone. I hate to say this, but I do believe my puppy is letting me know that she needs to go out. So I'm going to go ahead and end the specifically the YouTube stream right now. I do believe the Twitch stream will continue. This will also yeah. ironically open up another spot in chat for somebody to join the game. So I'm going to flash that on the screen real quick. Um, it's one final hurrah. I believe that information is still accurate. Uh, I will be bouncing out because my pretty puppy needs to go outside. Uh, thank you for joining us this evening. Uh, and if you want to continue watching, uh, do so right over on our Twitch chat at twitch.tv forward slash tripwire interactive. Thank you. Uh, actually, I think what? we should also use this point to, um, to uh, rotate some players. Okay. That's oh, okay. I can hop out if you need me to. Bye, everyone on my side.